It's my feel-good breakfast show. Now, all of us as South Africans do experience one thing. We have one common thing, and that is load shedding. It's a major pain for all of us. And with the current estimates, we're looking at at least another two years of persistent blackouts. But Pretoria-born uh, Elon Musk might just have a solution for this because the man behind Tesla Motors and SpaceX has just launched a new product called Tesla Powerwall uh, with the aim to keep the power on using batteries. And it could truly revolutionize the way in which we use energy. Uh, welcome, everyone, to basically the announcement of Tesla Energy. So this is this little product we call the Tesla Powerwall. It gives you peace of mind, so if there's a, if, if there's a, a cut in the utilities, you're always going to have power, particularly if you're in a place that's very cold. Now you, you, you don't have to worry about um, being out of power if there's, a, if there's an ice storm. Um, you can actually go, if you want, completely off-grid. You can take your solar panels, charge the battery packs, and that's, and that's all you use. Being able to just have this the solution that just works wherever you are, I think is going to be incredibly helpful to, to people that don't have electricity today. That is incredible news indeed. And with us in studio to give us a bit of an insight into this new technology is electromechanical engineering student uh, Christopher Stark, a man with a name quite appropriate for this kind of talk. How are you, sir? Good and yourself? Good to have you back. So we're talking about the Tesla Power Wall. You got a picture of that right there. Uh, why are people saying that this could actually be a game changer for the energy industry across the world? So what Tesla have done is they've taken a newer battery technology, so mm -hmm. lithium ion technology. Mm -hmm. What you normally use in, in an application like this is lead acid batteries. Okay. So the same sort of battery that would be in your car, mm -hmm. big, heavy, bulky, not really suited for uh, daily use. Yeah. So what they've done is they've used a lithium ion battery, which is what you get in your cell phone, what you get in your tablet, much newer, much lighter, much higher energy density. Yeah. So in a smaller package, more energy. Yeah. So lithium ion, the same kind of battery that we have in our phones. So yes. this is like a supercharged, super cell phone battery. It's like a mega huge cell phone battery. <laughs> mega huge. Mega <laughs> huge. <laughs> All right, so what would you need to do though in terms of the infrastructure of your house uh, to make this actually work and applicable? So what Tesla have said is they've made <laughs> it as easy as possible. So there are two versions of the, the device. There's the 10 kilowatt weekly version, okay. which uh, simply you plug in and it charges from the grid. Mm -hmm. And whenever you have power outs, so let's say load shedding, yeah. it'll kick in, your house will be fine. You'll have about two to three hours of power if you're using about two kilowatt hours of, of power. And then there's also the seven kilowatt version, which is a daily version. Okay. Now this is a little different. <clears throat> this is for people who want to put solar panels on their roof mm -hmm. or have wind power generators. So what you do is you store the excess solar energy in the day. And then when you really need it, like the mornings and the evenings, but unfortunately there's no solar, the battery kicks in yeah. and you use that power that you stored in the day to take you through the night. Wow, imagine having a setup like that. But I mean, of course, the, the, the whole point of this is to combat climate change. And we're looking at a possible future where, where we have sustainable energy that is zero carbon based. But is this, is this a reality? I mean, looking at what we have right now, we are completely, completely dependent on uh, the, the grid and the way in which we generate power right now. So is this a future that we're looking at as a possibility? Well, it's, it's definitely <coughs> not the, the game changing technology per se, but it's definitely a step in the right direction. Yeah. yeah. It's something to, to get us going faster, especially at the price point that Tesla has put it out as. Mm -hmm. it, uh, it's made it a lot more affordable for people to put large battery storage in their houses to yeah. make a huge difference. Yeah, and as, a, as an electromechanical uh, engineering student, how much, how much does this excite you in terms of what your future might hold? Because you could, you could be like him and come up with, a, with a, uh, you know, the next level in the solution uh, process, right? This is, it's, it's very exciting because it really, uh, they've put it in a nice sleek package. Yeah. It really appeals <laughs> to the, the average consumer. It's something that people will want to put in their houses, something that's easy to set up. It's, it's beautiful. Excellent <laughs> stuff, dude. Great having you here this morning. And that is it. It's called the, the Powerwall, the Tesla Powerwall, and retails at around $3,500 or 42,000 Rand per wall. But like I said, I mean, it's a, I think a small price to pay when you think about the future where you could have absolutely zero carbon-based and sustainable energy in your home. But right now, let's find out what else is coming up on your Feel Good Breakfast Show.